kind of feel like the Twitch streamer of graphic designers. so glad that you can join me for today's video whether you are a video editor looking for stock video or photos or copyright free music or maybe you're a designer who needs access to fonts or seamless patterns mock-ups or maybe you just want to see what's out there for creating digital planners and products like I do I actually have one place that you can turn to to get access to all of that and more. I get so many questions about the different creative assets that I use in my digital products as well as how I edit my videos, so I'll be letting you all in on that little secret today. Okay, so I intend for this to be kind of a more laid-back video. I kind of feel like the Twitch streamer of graphic designers at this very moment, but I thought this would be a fun and kind of different way to film this type of video, so we're gonna go for it. Okay, so the website actually that I use is called Envanto Elements, and I'm so, so happy to say that Evanto Elements is sponsoring today's video, so thank you so much, Evanto Elements. I am so very excited to dive into this website with you all. You'll also want to stay to the end of this video because I have a really amazing deal for you as far as Evanto goes. So I have actually been so impatient that I've already kind of dived in and made a few different collections on this website, and so I just have it organized kind of by design asset actually so i have a youtube collection i have an instagram collection i have a fonts collection mock-ups and procreate there is literally so much on this website that is kind of overwhelming actually like i just want to download everything and just dive into everything so i'm actually hoping to kind of find a few things that i like with you all download it um, and we can work on some projects together in this video. So I'm so, so excited. Okay, so Vanto Elements is basically the Netflix for designers. Uh, you actually just pay a subscription monthly. So you pay $16.50 a month. If you're a student, you actually get 30% off a subscription, which is really nice because I know as a student, it can be a little more difficult to pay for things because school is expensive. So yeah, you only have to pay $16.50 a month for your subscription and then you can download. You, you have an unlimited amount of downloads for so, so many things. So they have stock video, video templates, music, sound effects, graphic templates. They have different presentations. They also have like WordPress web templates, which would have been so helpful to know before just completely rebranding my website. So that's really, that's a really awesome feature that I haven't really seen anywhere else. So I, I'm just so excited to like just have, just to have like a subscription where you play a flat rate and then you get according to this, over 53 plus million unlimited creative downloads as far as this. Like, this is so amazing. Another thing with Avanto is that you don't have to worry so much about, is this copyright free? Am I allowed to use this in my products or whatever? Because it comes with a commercial license, the things that you download. So all Avanto element assets are covered by our lifetime commercial license. You can also cancel anytime. So I think this is really great because I know personally there is so much amazing things out there, but I'm always kind of hesitant to purchase it because I'm like, will I actually use this? What if I don't end up using this in my projects? And so Avanto really does give you the creative freedom to kind of just download and play around with a bunch of things and I think that's always really helpful for anyone who's getting involved into design. So I um, will show you some of the things that I saved in my collections. I'm so, so excited because the thing is with Avanto, you don't have to just go to Avanto for one project. So let's say I was creating a digital planner or a digital product. I can actually just turn to them if I want to have different pop-ups and different editing styles in my videos. I can use them for Instagram. I like saved a few Instagram story here stories. Uh, here like I saved some fonts that I thought were really cool and you can use fonts for literally everything uh, I have some mock-ups for different uh, Products or something and then procreate. I don't know what it is with procreate But I am obsessed and addicted to downloading a bunch of different brushes. This is kind of a problem actually So of course I had to look and see what Ivanto had for procreate as well Okay, so let's go ahead and dive into one of these collections So I'm kind of interested to see what I saved for YouTube 
Okay, so for YouTube, I saved a bunch of different like call out features. They have a bunch of different end screens as well as some subscribe elements to, to remind you all to subscribe. So maybe I should take that time to say, don't forget to subscribe before you head out. I think these are really awesome. I have downloaded a few Final Cut Pro plugins because that's what I use to edit my videos, but I really like the way these look. Um, and they also have like these little video features where you can just kind of watch the video itself. They have the description as well as what you get, and then you just click download. You can also download a preview, which is really interesting. I don't know which one I want to download and try. I mean, I guess the good thing about Avanto is that I can technically download all of it and try all of it. I also saved a few mockups. I know a lot of people were asking me where I get my mockups, and I actually have started creating my own mockups, but I think it's really nice to also turn to other designers to see what they're producing and supporting those designers, and so I saved a few of these mock-ups as well. So I saved a few laptop ones because I don't have any for my laptop per se. So I saved some of those. So I think I'll download those and kind of show you how you can use mock-ups as well. And then for Procreate, we all know I love Procreate and they have tons and tons of brushes and stamps on Avanto, which I'm so, so excited about. So I actually saved some brushes that I want to try. So I, I love stamps. I love the floral stamps and I have quite a few floral stamp brush collections in my Procreate, so I had to add this one as well. Really getting into shading for Procreate, so I added some shader brushes, here's some more stamp brushes, and uh, some Halloween related ones as well. So I'm so excited to download these and try them in Procreate with you. So let's actually look up a few things for our projects. Love the stuff, love the stuff. Let's check out some fonts. I get so many questions about what fonts I use and my favorite fonts, and so Evanto is a really good place to turn to for that. They literally have the cutest fonts. So this is the one that I had saved earlier, but as you can see, they have so many cute fonts. I feel like I could spend hours on this site. Like most of the Procreate stuff is under add-ons. All right, so let's look at some add-ons because that's where our Procreate brushes seem to be. They have a skin one. So I'm using this little bookmark feature to uh, add to my collection, but here you can create a new collection as well if you are using Advanto. Highly recommend. Ooh, I really like, oh, they have a pixel one. Ooh, I love the painterly texture of that one. Okay, so how about we download a few of these and play around with them. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's check out our YouTube collection here and try and download something that would be cool to have in my videos. So they have this unique call out feature one. So maybe I could incorporate that in a video somehow. I just think these look really smooth and nice. So let's download this one. We'll add it to the YouTube project. Download it as in a zip file. Unique callouts. I probably should read how to add it to Final Cut. I really don't like reading instructions. Let's just go with an older project that I have. So this is my how I take notes on my iPad project um, on Final Cut Pro. So if you haven't checked out that video yet, go check it out. But I am going to see what these callouts are like. If you guys see any different callouts or social media templates, it's probably coming from Avanto at this point. That's really awesome. So now we're going to play with some Procreate brushes. So these are just brush sets. Uh, if you haven't downloaded stuff for Procreate before, brushes or brush sets for Procreate before, you will just open up your iPad uh, to access these brush sets and then import them directly into Procreate and it just automatically goes to your brush library. So we're going to go ahead and play with some of those on my iPad. Okay, so now that we are over here back at my iPad, I have my iCloud drive open and we are just going to go in and import those brush files that we downloaded over at my computer. So I have them here. I already downloaded the Halloween one and now I'm going to download the lettering brush set that I also downloaded. So it's just gonna pop up with the Procreate icon and you're just gonna click it and then it'll import it directly to Procreate and already be in your brush library. So this is my Procreate and whenever I download new brushes, I really just like testing them out first. So I normally open up just the screen size canvas 
and then I go in your newer brushes will be at the top of your brush library and I like to go in and just test the brushes out so these look really really awesome so oh that's so cute so this is the pumpkin pumpkin stamp one it also has a flow feature so the pumpkins will actually follow your brush as well or your pencil as well so this looks like skulls oh i love that that is so cute pretty sure i have so many brushes that i haven't even had the chance to try or use yet yeah so this set came with 20 halloween stamp brushes which is really awesome then we have this lettering brush set, which also comes with 20 brushes. Oh, that is so nice. Then they have this one. I love the texture with these lettering brushes. I don't know if the texture is showing up that well on camera. This is a really nice grainy lettering brush. I really, really like that one. That was probably my favorite so far. I just love the texture on that one. Awesome. So maybe we can go in and create something. I'm really excited to dive into different projects with these. I really, really love the lettering brushes. And obviously the Halloween brush stamps are so, so cute. And so I can show you how to use a mock-up. So I really like the way these book pro mock-ups look. So most mock-ups will be with Photoshop. So I'm going to click add and download and I will show you how you can use mock-ups. Usually they'll include like a little guide to show you how. Okay, so now that we have Photoshop open, it looks like we put our whatever we want on our screen right there. So let's say I want to include a mock-up of Avanto. I'll just take a screenshot of the web page, And maybe we can put that on our little MacBook mock-up here. Okay. So then, so I'll come up here, click File, click Place Embedded, and I'm just going to resize it to this. Command S. And then it just populates onto your computer. Mockups are really, really handy, and they're honestly pretty easy to use. I save it as a PNG, which is just an image file. So I'll come up here to File, go down to Export, and then do Quick Export as PNG. You can also do Export As, I guess, and change the file type. So that is how you use Avanto Elements. As you can see, there is literally so much. You could spend literal hours or days, honestly, on this website downloading all these creative files. I'm really just so excited about this platform and this website because I can. there's so much potential here. Like, I, I'm getting so many different ideas for different products and different projects that I can use just surfing through this website. It's really, really nice. So I actually have a 70% off discount using Avanto. Check out my description. I'll make sure to have all the deets down there for you to check out. But I'm so, so excited and I want to thank Avanto Elements again for sponsoring this video. I really, really love this website. I'm so impressed with everything that they offer. I know that this is the website I'm going to be turning to first as far as what I want to download for my projects. Literally so many different things for Procreate and fonts and YouTube and Instagram. There's literally so much and I don't think they're short of anything for any designer, whether you're a video editor or a graphic designer or maybe you are a digital artist or a painter or whatever. They have so many different things on here. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you can see like all the potential that Avanto has. So let me know if you download or use anything for Avanto. I would love to share secrets about all the cool things on this website. Like if you find a really awesome font or Procreate brushes, do let me know. I would love to go check it out on Avanto. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and kind of the way I filmed this video. Just uh, be more laid back and kind of sit on this website and see what trouble we can get into as far as 
uh, downloading all these things for our project. Please don't forget to like and comment on this video. It really does help me out. And don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already subscribed to me. I post videos every week and I would love to have you join the fam. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week with another video. Thank you.